Tough Mudder is this weekend in Oxford. It's a fun, muddy obstacle course that a Livonia man participated in last year, but never finished after going into cardiac arrest. And lucky for him, he was saved by another competitor who was a Monroe firefighter. Seven Night Shoes reporter Simon Trowdery sits down with both men to talk about what happened last year and how they will be honored this weekend. School is coming to an end here at Berkeley High School, and one teacher is kicking off his summer break by honoring the man who helped save his life. This is just a glimpse of what Tough Mudder is all about. French teacher Dave Bebo was excited to participate even though he was a newbie. These are pictures taken before hitting the six mile mark. That's when he fell down leaving his friends and other participants worried. Somebody said I think he's having a seizure, you know, that obviously caught my attention. Lieutenant Scott Smiley is a Monroe firefighter who noticed the crowd gathering around Dave. Once someone yelled Dave did not have a pulse, he knew he was in cardiac arrest. Scott and a few others rotated as they did CPR and waited for an AED. They worked on him for nearly 30 minutes until Dave was rushed to the hospital. Usually when people are down that long, it's usually not not a good outcome. Dave does not remember much of that day, nor the next eight days because he was unconscious. He tells us he flatlined about 20 times. And they told my wife that I probably wasn't going to make it. Dave didn't have any heart issues before, so this came as a shock to his family. Somehow he survived, surprising even the hospital staff who nicknamed him Miracle Man. Wow, we, we can't believe you made it. We really thought you were a goner. Scott went on to finish the competition and reached out to Dave's family for an update. Once Dave was out of the hospital, they met up and they're now friends bonded by the scary situation. At this weekend's Tough Mudder, both will be honored. Even though this firefighter is a hero, he's too humble to accept that title. It's, it's just helping. I mean, that's what we do. Dave and Scott are hoping their story will inspire more people to get CPR training and more places to have AEDs to help save lives. I'm Simon Chowdhury for 7 Action News. Yeah, what a special bond they have now. Thank you, Simon. Well,